This video is brought to you by Miniature Market. Thousands of board games, miniatures, and paints, discount prices at miniaturemarket.com. The Kingdom of East Anglia saw the birth of their greatest son, an Anglo-Saxon warrior destined to be a champion for the ages and a national treasure for all time. Hope you're doing well today. Today we're going to be looking at a book that, um, a sequel to a book that I really raved about. Um, I always said that that if you got tired of playing Blood Rage because you can only play so much Blood Rage, that those figures are beautiful. Wouldn't it be cool if you were able to use them in some sense? Well, with Ragnarok you were able to use them. Well, guess what? We have Ragnarok, the Venari, and this sequel adds a whole bunch of new things like new god powers, new war clans, new scenarios, new weapons, all these wonderful things as well as just just uh, 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 this fantastic story that as the author said in the book he has so much more story to tell and that only means good things for us because not only can you use your blood rage uh, miniatures but after taking a look in this book there's plenty plenty of these creatures that you can find at reaper miniatures now uh i, I was lucky enough to tour there and boy after reading through this and taking a look at some of the enemies and looking at all the stuff that was at reaper go get some of the minis put it together paint them and then break this out and I guarantee you're going to have a blast. Let's go down to the table, take a look at Ragnarok. And, well, you judge for yourself. So we're going to take a look at this book, Ragnarok the Veneur. And uh, from Tim uh, Korolowski. There we go. I think we got it. Um, the original book was just fantastic. But reading inside this, the author says basically that he's not done telling the story which is good for us because there's just even more to this and it's just another masterpiece uh breaks down uh, contents gives you everything that you need to know the new campaigns the corruptions the sailing now mounted mod uh models um they're going to have new weapons, god powers, um, and of course the new clan, which is just really sends this uh, over the top. And the new beastery with more and more models. Um, the great thing about this, it gives you an overview of everything on how it all works. And then we go right into uh, the new faction. And the new war clan is the Forest Walkers, which are basically, it looks like, Indians. So you have Plain Walkers, Shamans, you have uh, Snow Walkers, Swamp Walkers, and a War Chief. Uh, you're going to have new weapons and special god powers. You're going to have Ebola, of course, and that was used, of course. Harpoons, blowguns, that type of stuff. Uh, bows. Um, just a, a, a ton of fantastic thing and of course all this fantastic and beautiful art that goes with this and really just makes this just just a, a, such an incredible experience um, you're gonna go through and you got new campaign rules uh, which are fantastic um, you're going to also have some new weapons uh, as we roll through here and uh, just to skip ahead a little bit, uh, just going over some, some new rules that are going to uh, just make this even better, of course. Uh, the new rules for the mounted, uh, for the mounted models. Uh, the real cool thing is that we're going to get back uh, is that you now have ships in this, which, okay, I'm all in. Um, a whole bunch of brand new scenarios, uh, just just this is just something turning out to be something that's just absolutely fantastic and what I want to do is skip ahead uh, we'll take a look at some of the things here in the beastery and yeah look at that thing huh all right tell me you can't get that at Reaper models I'm sure you can uh, just some un 
unbelievable things. Uh, an abilities list, but at the very end, you're going to be getting the long ship te uh, templates. And what this is going to do is give you a template because now you can have ship battles, you have a turning gauge, and uh, that's pretty much the kind of size that you really kind of want to have here. Uh, going in so now you can have all kinds of battles going on and you know that's pretty much it again uh, there was something really neat here they tell you where to get the the miniatures I really suggest Reaper miniatures uh, go there they usually have something for everything and they do just a, such a fantastic job anyways I mean Reaper miniatures has to be one of the best in the business uh, again another fantastic book from our good friends at Osprey Games and of of course Ragnarok Rock just fills another void with another fantastic edition and with more to come so let's go up top and get my final thoughts and uh, we'll see what I say about Ragnarok another uh, another another fantastic book by by Tim I just can't believe the depth and the beauty inside here, the art is fantastic. I mean, after reading a little bit of this, you just want to jump on this table and just start playing. And this book is fantastic. Uh, it just adds, I, I, I was, I, you know, when I got it in the mail, I went, oh my God, what's this? And I was just completely, again, blown away. I said, oh, Ragnarok, they must have like a follow-up or something like that. Well, it's so much more. And the author has so much more of a story to tell that I'm sure this isn't the, the, the last of this heavy metal series. I love the Forest Walkers. I think they're fantastic. Um, it just adds another dimension. Uh, and it reminds me of that movie Pathfinder where... Uh, where, where the Vikings came on and, and were taking on the Indians. It, it just adding that in here, it was, you know, the, the forest walkers really adds another dimension to it. So uh, just a fantastic, fantastic book. I suggest you get it when it comes out. Uh, just to give you another good look at it. From Morpheus Engine and Osprey Games, of course. Make sure you check this out. This is just another of a long list of masterpieces from our good friends at Osprey Books. Until next time, it's your old friend Rob. We will see you soon. Stay in the game, and you could get this from Miniature Market, right, Grandpa? <laughs> you could get this from Miniature Market. That's right. Yeah, everything you need. Bye.